Welcome to Elon Musk's Signal Channel. During the fourth Starship test flight, issues with the heat shield, especially the joints between the shield and the main body, nearly caused a disaster for the rocket. Despite this, Starship still successfully landed, demonstrating remarkable resilience. Recognizing the critical importance of the heat shield, SpaceX is actively improving it in preparation for Starship Flight 5. So what special solutions will be implemented? What notable updates will Flight 5 bring? Let's explore in the video right now. Following Flight 4, significant progress has been made on Starship's heat shield issue. SpaceX has developed a new type of heat shield tile that is twice as durable as the previous version, meaning the risk of cracking or peeling has been halved. The old heat shield tiles could withstand temperatures up to 2600 degrees Celsius, sufficient to melt aluminum, a common rocket body material. However, with the new heat shield tiles, this figure has been raised to an astonishing 2930 degrees Celsius. The hexagonal structure cleverly eliminates straight paths for hot gases to seep through gaps, significantly enhancing the heat shield's durability during re-entry. By addressing weaknesses identified in recent tests, SpaceX is steadily transforming Starship into a more reliable and safer vehicle for future missions, including those with crew. Elon Musk has revealed a new enhancement for Starship's heat shield. Beneath the primary heat-resistant tiles, SpaceX will add an ablative layer. This secondary defense layer provides additional protection in case the primary tiles crack or peel during launch or re-entry. The ablative material is designed to burn slowly and manage intense heat during re-entry, absorbing a tremendous amount of thermal energy. This sacrificial material acts as a backup heat shield, safeguarding the primary heat-resistant tiles and the spacecraft structure from the greatest heat source. While specifics about the ablative material have not been disclosed, Elon Musk likened it to silicon felt, a non-reusable material that ensures safety for the spacecraft and crew in case of damage to the primary tile. Thanks to this layer, the overall heat resistance capability of Starship's heat shield will be significantly increased. SpaceX is not only reinforcing the heat shield, but also aiming to enhance Starship's overall heat resistance. This secondary erosion-resistant material has the potential to allow the spacecraft to endure higher re-entry speeds and more severe thermal conditions, something the primary heat-resistant tiles alone may struggle with over multiple uses. Interestingly, SpaceX tested the secondary erosion-resistant material during the fourth flight, deliberately removing heat-resistant tiles from specific locations. These vacant spots, situated in critical areas like the engine bay periphery, could cause serious damage if steel were to melt. Additionally, another tile appeared thinner compared to the rest, part of Starship's ongoing experiments to reduce overall spacecraft weight, a strategy that could be applied in future test versions. The comprehensive overhaul of the heat shield not only reinforces heat resistance, but also represents SpaceX's key strategy for rapidly reusable Starships. The insulation layer between stainless steel and the heat-resistant tile layer will be replaced to incorporate additional secondary erosion-resistant material. A thinner heat shield also facilitates the integration of this material. By increasing the durability and reliability of the heat shield, SpaceX aims to minimize complex repair and maintenance tasks between flights. This not only enhances spacecraft safety, especially for crewed missions, but also aligns with SpaceX's broader goal, making space travel more cost-effective and sustainable. Although results from the two mini heat shield tests have yet to be announced, SpaceX's immediate application of these changes to Starship Flight 5 demonstrates significant improvement effort. Currently, the process of removing and installing the new heat shield tiles on Starship 30 is underway. The outcomes of these changes will be highly practical, helping to accurately assess the effectiveness of each improvement method. The re-entry phase of a spacecraft is one of the most technically challenging stages, especially concerning the performance of the heat shield. Using ceramic tiles for SpaceX's Starship heat shield presents significant challenges. Although ceramic can withstand high temperatures, it is brittle and prone to cracking. This brittleness makes the tiles susceptible to mechanical stress during launch and re-entry. A major issue with ceramic tiles is their tendency to expand and contract due to temperature changes. 
During launch, rockets endure strong vibrations that cause structural expansion and contraction. In space, the spacecraft faces extreme cold, followed by intense heat during Earth re-entry. Ceramic tiles must withstand significant thermal expansion and contraction. Keeping these tiles intact and properly adhered to the spacecraft under these conditions is a major technical challenge, reminiscent of the heat shield challenges on the space shuttle. Even the space shuttle, which also used ceramic tiles for its heat shield, faced similar challenges. The tiles on the space shuttle required meticulous inspection and frequent costly repairs after each flight, significantly prolonging preparation time for subsequent missions. The repair process demands extensive manpower and expenses, because each tile needs careful inspection and replacement if damaged. SpaceX is not only improving the durability of the tiles, but also integrating an additional secondary protective layer to overcome these challenges. This dual-layer approach provides redundancy in case the primary tiles are damaged, absorbing and dissipating heat to prevent damage to the spacecraft. Drawing from the Space Shuttle's experience and advancing heat shield technology, SpaceX is aiming for a more robust and reusable system. This is a crucial factor in the company's goal of rapid reusability, reducing the need for extensive post-flight repairs and shortening preparation time for Starship mission. Elon Musk declared Starship as the most powerful flying object ever created, with six Raptor engines on Starship and 33 engines on the Super Heavy booster. The current thrust of Starship is already twice as powerful as the legendary Saturn V rocket. The power of Starship doesn't stop there. Elon Musk revealed that the rocket could potentially become even more powerful with future upgrades, achieving triple the current thrust. Interestingly, in a recent SpaceX report, they inadvertently disclosed details about adding more engines to Starship and Super Heavy. Covered this update in a previous video. Following the success of the first four Starship launches, SpaceX is maintaining an astonishing pace of development. In just a month, we will witness the fifth launch. This rapid succession compared to the long intervals between previous launches indicates significant improvements in manufacturing processes and issue resolution. Initial delays were caused by substantial damage at the launch site and technical issues needing resolution on the Starship rocket itself. Now, with reinforced infrastructure and fine-tuned rockets, SpaceX can conduct more frequent test flights to optimize technology and gather data. Elon Musk has promised a bright future for Starship, and SpaceX is demonstrating this with solid strides. Similar to the peak of the Apollo program, where 13 Saturn V rockets were built and launched in just four years, SpaceX is constructing a massive factory for mass-producing Starship systems. This achievement is not only a technical milestone, but also evidence of SpaceX's determination to turn Starship into a reliable spacecraft for future space transportation. And that wraps up today's video. Stay tuned for more exciting events from SpaceX in their journey to conquer space. Thank you for watching. Please leave your comments on today's broadcast. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Catch more interesting videos on the Elon Musk Signal channel. Goodbye, and see you next time.